Hello guys, it's Chumass100 here. Today I am reviewing a Lurback deck. This time we have Bouge and Dragoon. This actually only comes in the Battlefield Kiwami set, which I decided to not review the whole thing because that's, uh, the stadium's really not good and it just kind of takes a while to deal with. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to review the Bakugan. Anyway, this is Bouge and Dragoon. The Dragoon piece is actually the same as the Jagan Dragoon, but the Bouge piece is exclusive to this set. So... Yeah, just give you a nice look at this Bakugan while it is closed. And let's go ahead and open it up. Let me see if I'm... Uh... Okay, there we go. And he opens up like that. You probably see he looks really, really cool. And if you actually see... His G power kind of it's 720 it's right here I tried to show it closer to the camera in a previous take of this video but it would not focus so you'll just have to either try and hopefully see that or just take my word for it um, but yeah this Bakugan is really nice I do like it quite a lot at least in terms of appearance um, so yeah this can switch modes, the head can come down or just be up like this, but that's the only mode change. It just has the two modes, unlike Jigen, which has the four. Now then, this Bakugan's a kind of a weird case. I'm just going to say personally, I do give this thing a 9 out of 10. I really like this um, Bakugan. I think it's really cool. I like the Bojan piece a lot. And also the Translucent Dragon looks cool. Competitively, this thing's weird. So I'm going to give it an... Uh, Honestly, I gotta give this thing like a 9 out of 10 for competitive as well, because it is really good. Like, this thing is insanely good, because it is a uh, Dragon. But, it does fall a bit flat. Now, I have two notes to give with this thing. First up, um, while I did give it a 9 out of 10, that sounds really good, but there is no reason to use this thing over uh, the original Dragon Dragon, because... Jigen, that piece is just a lot better than Bujin. But also, um, the other note I wanted to give is that this is 720Gs. The original Dragon is only 700. So, if you actually take this Dragon piece and the original Jigen piece, um, you can make a better version of Dragon. And if you want to go even crazier, if you take the Friendship Bind version of Jigen and put it on this... Uh, you can actually make a 750G Bakugan because that Jigen piece, for some reason, just gives you 30 extra Gs. So if you are trying to make a top tier, absolutely perfect deck, um, <laughs> I guess this is a component that you will need. But, I mean, I don't know many people who still play with Bakugan deck. And if they do, I mean, they probably actually don't play, they're probably just collectors like me. Uh, I mean, I do test stuff, but I don't really have anyone else who I know in person who plays, so that's unfortunate, but yeah. Um, so if you are someone who really, I guess, wants to make like a perfect uh, Gigan Dragon, then yeah, I would recommend this, um, or at least trying to find one of these. If not, it's mostly just a collector's item because Bougin is significantly worse than the original. But yeah, I want to make a review on this guy because, I mean, I've had him for a long time, for over five years now, and I thought, you know, I should probably finally get around to it because I have reviews of the other Dragons, which um, are in various different reviews, such as, like, the Dragon Legends set, which goes over the first three, and then also I have a review of the Dragon deck, which goes over the, uh, well, the regular version of Dragon Dragon, not this uh, variant of sorts. But yeah, anyways, that's all for this video, so, overall, pretty cool Lachrion, who is... Um, I mean, just really cool and really good, but despite being really good, he's still outclassed. So yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, and bye-bye.